Hello everyone, I'm Arid Zamakola. I'm the CEO and co-founder of Resolve Clock. Imagine significantly enhancing the key insight you can extract from raw ultrasound data while preserving all the key characteristics of this beautiful imaging modality, the number one, safety, portability, accessibility. We are doing that at Resolve Clock, now it's possible, and we are starting with neuro imaging just the beginning. Today, lack of imaging kills, that's quite sure. Early diagnosis can cure most deadly diseases. Unfortunately, and stroke is a prime example of that, and just with one in four adults likely to experience a stroke, timely detection will be very crucial. Unfortunately, today, current imaging tools fall short for bedside diagnosis, fall short for diagnosis in the ambulances, at patient bedside, in the hospital. And the result is that 40 million stroke patients will be diagnosed too late, every year. To implement widespread screening, to provide the diagnostic at the right time, at the right place, and thus save life, we need to increase by 100-fold the accessibility of CT scan or MRIs. The solution lies in enhancing the, raw, the data that you can extract from raw ultrasound data. Today, with just 10% of the raw data extracted and then treated in the ultrasound card, we are able to achieve remarkable results, and you know that. What if, if we could harness one extract and treat 100% of the raw ultrasound data? That's not just a dream, that's not just a slide. For example, our co-founder has already demonstrated in nature that we are able to improve by 10 the resolution of raw ultrasound, of our, of ultrasound in general. And that's possible now. And he bypassed the limits of the physics with that. Why we are able to do that now? Because now you have to see the ultrasound card like a computer, where you are able to play with, as, with the software to play with this data. And we are now able to replicate the beautiful story of ultrasound in cardiology in other segments, thanks to this play with uh, software. And we are starting with no imaging. We decided to create the company two years ago because the hardware was finally mature enough to integrate our first engines inside our first card called Silver Air. But we designed our software, our engines, from the beginning to be integrated into other hardware systems. What we are doing, in fact, we are building software, operating system from raw data to the collection of the raw data to the endpoints for the physicians, for the patients. For example, with our first engine, with one acquisition of with, with our ultrasound, we collect 300 gigabytes of data, and then we have endpoints, very good endpoints. We are not just revolutioning a specific medical workflow at patient bedside, in the hospital. We have now much more data. And with this data, we can pioneer a whole new category of predictive insight. We have a very pragmatic approach as a young startup. We focus on neurocritical care, neuro-intensive care units with a first brain monitoring here. We are developing stroke biomarkers with our data, and we are investigating other areas, such as monitoring of transplant just after the surgery. But the key opinion leaders are already inventing new opportunities, such as monitoring of neurodegenerative diseases, such as monitoring tumor aggressiveness, for example. We, made, we have made significant strides fast-tracking the introduction of first 3D brain ultrasound device called Silver, integrating our first engine called RS NeuroSuite. This is Silver and is now available for clinical research. With Silver, we are, in fact, we are filling gaps where there is no alternative. Uh, for our first use case in, in neurocritical care, the, the idea is to replace conventional Doppler. It's a better alternative to conventional Doppler and to uh, invasive probes, for instance. And here you have a picture of our device in an uh, intensive care unit in your room with our physician. It's already a game changer because with ultrasound, we are able to provide detailed morphology, mapping of brain vascularization. We are able to provide perfusion, like in CT scan. We are able to provide non-user dependent 3D velocity mapping. That's really important to accelerate treatment and the diagnosis at patient bedside. 
silver could already bring significant medical economic benefits to hospitals. In fact, it enhances the utilization of MRI and CT scan by, especially with outpatient. It reduces the transportation costs and associated risk for the patient. And more importantly, it helps shorten hospital stay by accepting treatment because it's a bedside tool. Why we are able to do that at Resort Rook? In fact, we are able to do that because we can bring together physicists, physicians, and industry leaders. And for example, our co-founder, Olivier Couture, is one of the most famous physicists in the world for ultrasound. We have Anthony Samir, Professor Anthony Samir from Harvard Medical School School. We have industry veterans such as Brian McIsron, a former vice president of uh, General Imaging Ultrasound at GS Care globally. And we are able to do that because we bring together this type of profiles. We are, in fact, transforming care by expanding the global imaging market into new areas, into blue oceans, starting with neuro monitoring. But in our view, our data, our biomarkers, have the potential to create companion diagnostic tools. And that's our next step. As I mentioned earlier, we are able to integrate our software into other hardware, but we have a pragmatic approach here. We have a direct cell model at the beginning. We are able to sell the comprehensive device, but we, we have in mind to put our software into other hardware systems. But beyond this royalty-based revenue, quite basic for AI in, in ultrasound, we are, our biomarkers have the potential to foster value-based partnership for healthcare providers, for payers. We have already a strong demand for clinical partnerships in Europe, in the US. Uh, we, they want co-development. We are focusing on our first uh, use case, ICUs, adult ICUs, uh, for uh, neuro monitoring at patient bedside. But we have demand for pediatrics monitoring. We have demand for monitoring transplant uh, after the surgery, and so on. It underscores the urgency of, and the value of our, uh, of our products, of our technologies. And to, to, to conclude, uh, we have now access to this amazing data. So if you are a physician, uh, if you are a medtech, a pharma, and you see an opportunity to have access to this data, feel free to, to reach out. And we, we, have, we had the first preceded run last year, a $2 million preceded run last year. And given the amazing results we have uh, with our first clinical trials, the co-development of our first product uh, called Siever, we want now to accelerate, so if you can help us to accelerate, feel free to contact me. Thank you very much.